Hello, my name is Sarah Copeland, and today I'll be talking about GeneMarker HID Software's paternity testing application. The basic functions of GeneMarker HID are covered in the introductory webinar, which we encourage you to watch before beginning this webinar. GeneMarker HID Human Identity Software's embedded paternity analysis follows the AABB standards for relationship testing laboratories, Appendix 8, for determination of paternity and maternity for family trios, motherless cases, and reverse parentage. The point-and-click operation enables the analyst to directly access the application after genotyping, which avoids error-prone data transfer. Draw pedigrees, providing accurate and rapid comparison of STR profiles from family members. Verifies paternity exclusion or inclusion by identifying allele conflicts between parents and children or siblings with results in a table and pedigree graphic. Deduces missing parent profile based on offspring allele calls where possible. The analyst can select from two options for relationship statistics classical paternity trio calculations using the PI formulas of AABB standards and relationship testing laboratories Appendix 8 with PI, PE, CPI, CPE, and POP and an exportable table. Identity by descent providing likelihood ratios of related versus random individuals in a population both methods in GeneMarker HID software use the mutation rates of AABB and preloaded allele frequency tables for U.S. populations or easily import allele frequencies of other population databases. Now I'll open GeneMarker HID and load my raw data files. Click the green triangle or go to Project Run to open up the Run Wizard. The default settings are compatible with most analyses, so I'll simply choose my template, click Next, Next, and then OK. This is the time to review the data and make any necessary edits. For more information about these preliminary steps, we encourage you to watch the introductory GeneMarker HID webinar. Then, when that's complete, you can proceed to Applications, Relationship Testing. Go to Tools, Family Group Tool to group samples by family, Group by Sections, Fixed Positions, or Order. In this case, we'll group by sections due to the naming structure. Set identifiers on the right for mother, father, and child. Click the Match button, then click OK. Each family's pedigree is automatically created and can be shown by using the drop-down. This is an example of paternity non-exclusion. There are no conflicts between the parents and child. Right-click on the Child's node to select Family. On the right, you can review the traces. Use the Die button to toggle between the different die channels. Right-mouse-click and choose Edit Node to input information or set a parent as contested to activate the Paternity Index calculations. Select the appropriate allele frequency table by going to Tools, Allele Frequency. There are a few allele frequency populations preloaded into the program, but you can easily import others by using the Import button. We are happy to provide examples of formatted allele frequency tables upon request. The PI is displayed in the PI column of the table to the right. By going to the Calculations Details tab, you can see the results for every locus. You can save this table by right mouse clicking and choosing to copy or to save it as a text file. This enables you to copy-paste the information into your lab's report template. Here is an example of paternity exclusion. Hover over the node to display the markers in conflict. Click a marker to see the corresponding electropherograms. Markers in conflict with the alleged parent are in red font in the pedigree. Some may be uninformative. 
Others indicate a leal conflict with the alleged father. Alleles that are consistent with uniparental disomy are displayed on the same side of the pedigree diagram, as is the case with FGA here. Save a copy of the pedigree by right mouse clicking and choosing the export image, or save pedigree file by pressing the save button in the toolbar. The file may be opened at a later date, and additional children may be added. If you'd like to manually draw the pedigrees, go to File, New Pedigree. Fill in identifiers and select the sample file from either the current project or from the database. Then click OK. Right mouse click on the node and select Add Mate and provide the necessary information. Right mouse click on the node again, select Add Child, and then provide the necessary information. Select the appropriate allele frequency to display the PI results. Thank you for watching this Gene Marker HID webinar. For more information, or a free 30-day trial of GeneMarker HID or other Soft Genetics products, please visit www.softgenetics.com or email info at softgenetics.com. For technical support questions, please write to tech underscore support at softgenetics.com. Thank you for watching.